today on Santa Monica Update. Coming up, we'll take you inside the Marion Davies birthday party. Your source for local news in Santa Monica. San in honor of what would have been her 115th birthday, Santa Monica Conservancy docents turn the spotlight on Marion Davies, actress, philanthropist, famed party hostess, and mistress of media tycoon William Randolph Hearst. Reporter Tamara Henry dusted off her 1930s hat and joined in the fun. To Marion, the darling of her era, beloved by her friends, and remembered by her fans to this day, to Marion. To Marion. Here, here. Her philanthropy, her spectacular hostess abilities, uh, her business acumen. The birthday celebration took place in the Marion Davies Guest House. That and the pool are all that remain of the sprawling mansion, which is now a public facility open to all and no membership required. Guests listen to stories about her fascinating life as they toured from room to room. In his newspapers, he wrote glowing reviews of her, and they were so over the top on the review side that his rival newspapers decided they would write horrible reviews of her. And so this became sort of the curse of her life in these silent films in New York. One special guest owed her start in Hollywood acting to Marion Davies. The young girl was making just $2 a week when her father lost their house during the Depression. And so one day we were here uh, on the beach and uh, the maid came out and said, how would you like, how would you kids like to work in the movies? Oh, we love that. Thanks to Marion, she was then under contract with MGM, making $75 a week, with which she was able to support her entire family. One fabulous example of Marion's generosity and hospitality. Marion was like the bubbles in a glass of champagne. And so was everyone else, getting into the spirit of the times as they arrived in their own Gold Coast era attire, or dipping into the 1930s props hamming it up for the photo booth, as if attending one of Davy's famed costume parties. Marion was a brilliant mimic in silent films and talkies, a comedic actress who was glamorous and funny and adored by so many. Uh, everything about her uh, was magical. To Marion Davies, whose inner glow lit up the screen and who taught William Randolph Hearst how to tap dance. Make sure to get your docent guided tour of the Marion Davies Guest House. Reporting for Santa Monica Update, I'm Tamara Henry. The Annenberg Community Beach House always has something fun and inspiring happening. To check dates and times and get parking reservations for the Annenberg Community Beach House, just go to AnnenbergBeachHouse.com. The city often wins awards for public projects, and here's an unusual one. Our brand new beach restrooms have been called the 2011 Project of the Year by the American Public Works Association. This prestigious award is only given to projects that are unique and innovative and which contribute to the quality of life including sustainability and environmental awareness. The new public restrooms bring six new and one renovated ADA compliant facilities to the beach. These facilities have low maintenance finishes and fixtures and take advantage of our mild climate by maximizing natural daylighting, passive cooling and air circulation. And our historic beach culture and natural resources are an important part of the project. Interpretive elements consisting of perforated metal panels are the privacy screens at each facility. Unique to each are panels that depict historically significant site features or events including our red sandstone bluffs, Inkwell Beach, images of the Tongva culture, Grunions, beach volleyball, and our historic yacht harbor. Congratulations to everyone who helped make these new public conveniences a reality. Well, that's it for this edition of Santa Monica Update. I'm Keena Chin, and for all of us at City TV, thanks for watching.